everyone, it's Veronica and I'm back with another video. I'll be doing swatches of the Sephora favorites Give Me Some Nude Lip set that I recently purchased from Sephora. Now, uh, the cost was $28, um, which is about £20.69, um, and the value of the whole kit is £86. Now, for me, this is a perfect opportunity to try out several different types of lipsticks. Um, I know Sephora does other kits as well. They have one on their website at the moment which I can't get my hands on because it has got an nail varnish in it. So um, it, it's the great value, just to put it blankly. Now I'll go straight into it. So this is how it comes packaged. And I'll pick out the lipsticks or lip products. So the first one I have it's a Mark Jacobs looks like a lip pencil to me um, and it's in shade this is terrible terrible it's a pout liner long wear a lip pencil in the shade primrose or primrose right so it's a twist up so just like that Ah, now it's it's quite nice. Um, so I would say also to a brownish nude. Doesn't smell of anything. Yeah, I, I I like the shade, so I'll give that a go. The next one is the nude stick lip and cheek pencil in Whisper. Now, I am not particularly keen on lip and cheeks cheek pencils. I prefer powder for my cheeks rather than. Well, pencil to be honest. So, oh, but it's nice and smooth and creamy, and it's quite a nude color. So yeah, I, I quite like that. Now the next one is the Tartist Tartist lip paint from Tarte in the shade. Now they have a list on the back of the box. Let me have a look. Du, du, du. Namaste. Right. Let's have a look. Hold on. So, there we go. So, quite nice and clean. Dolph duplicator. It looks quite creamy. And indeed, it is. And again, it's a quite a nice pinky nude. Well, it looks pinky nude on the camera. Pinky nude. There we go. So, yeah, I know that that this is the, the recent launch. So I was quite wanting to get my hands on it. So I was quite glad they came up with a set where it was included. Now, Laura Mercier. I do have another lipstick from her. It's in a really weird brown shade. This is in Milky Way. Fingers crossed. It's going to be better than the first one. So, eh, I. Don't know. It looks scaringly similar. It's more of a nude there, but it does look. I don't know. It's. It looks quite sheer, but I don't know. I didn't like the first one, so I'll try it. We'll see how it goes. I'm already opening it. <laughs> uh, right, Nars. Everybody talks about NARS, everybody loves NARS, as far as I'm aware, Audacious lipsticks. I don't have any. I have one from another set, which was, again, a Sephora um, favorite set. Now, this one is in Dolce Vita. So, I did the packaging. is not magnetic, like the other one is. Um, and it's a sheer formula. formula. So, it's, it's just there, so quite quite nude. I think it's going to be quite well for my uh, my uh, job. I don't tend to wear bright lipsticks to work so um, <clears throat> and I need something that keeps it moisturized so I think that will do a good job. It's, it's still the velvet packaging with the NARS around it so I mean it's going to look good on the stand. So yeah so there we go. All the shades right there. Um, and that's it from me. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon.